24 heures dans la vie d'une femme. 24 hours in the life of a woman by Stefan Zweig. Uh, this is the name I hear, I heard in the French version of this book. I don't know how you say his name in English, but uh, and the book was read in uh, in, in French. Uh, by the way, mm, I found it on a list of best 100 books novels, works by uh, fiction, uh, which was, uh, which is listed online by Le Monde. So I guess this is in a way a French replica, a French answer to some rather famous uh, lists produced by the Anglo-Saxon world, the Guardian list, Time, um, Modern Library. Here we have uh, Novels speaking, novels or works uh, written in French, mixed together with uh, uh, those written in English. But there are very few similarities, uh, very few works which are on the time or modern library at least can be found on the Le Monde list. Um, so this this is a great work. It starts on a in a resort, in a hotel in a resort, in France, where there are various families. There's one with a mother and uh, one or two children. Uh, that escapes me. But um, anyway, uh, a, a daughter. The daughter has a good relationship with a man, but it turns out that this man who is playing with the daughter runs away with the wife. I thought we were going to follow this uh, story, but no. Uh, in fact, um, we turn, I mean, the author, his wife, moves uh, the attention towards a young woman who was there at the hotel and the older woman. The older woman starts to tell her story. Her 24 hours are in her life uh, a couple of decades back, I, I think it was. And so she tells us how she liked to study the roulette, people in the casino, and especially their hands. In fact, I've read this uh, in another place that you can tell so much about uh, people of by just looking at their hands. Uh, what comes to mind now is that if you look at mine, you see that I don't work in the fields. And then some other hands would be those, you can see this one is doing uh, hard work, a workshop in the fields, and this one doesn't. It works with a computer other than that. But anyway, she, she was good at that. She saw this young man who was very troubled, uh, walking out of the casino, she saw him on the verge of committing suicide, jumping from a high cliff, or what was it, um, to his death. She saves him. Uh, not only that, she helps him with some money, but then there is a surprise at the end. But she never lost some water, but the last is the trash. It's a story of uh, helping someone only to find that you are disappointed uh, even if you invested so much uh, emotions uh, into that. Very interesting, uh, good book. For good reason, as I said, listed by Lamun among the best. Huh? Au revoir.